So today I'm going to show you how to make this climbing frame. I made this over on TikTok, um, but I wanted to show you more in depth on here. So the first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is do two 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 by two rooms, and I've left a gap big enough to fit a swing set in. And above it, I'm just making them that goes all the way across. I delete the front of the walls here so you can see what's going on. But there are three swing sets that I have. I have the one from Seasons, which look fits perfectly fine under here. There is the one from Island Living, which sticks through, but I want to use this one. And there's also the um, one from the new kit, which fits perfectly fine underneath as well. But I'm going to end up using the Island Living one for this, just because it's what I wanted to use. And I size this down by 0 0.92 or 0 0.93 um, using the tool mod. Then I'm going to pop the roofs on either side and just copy it across using the little copy tool. Then I'm going to place down at some monkey bars and I'm just doing this coming off the climbing frame that I've already got down here. And I'm going to build a room around this. You'll see why later on, um, but I'm going to change two of the walls to spandrels. So I'm just changing these either side of the monkey bars into spandrels and deleting the ceiling. And I'll be using that wall that's on the end for something else later on. So now I'm gonna put these up by one using the platform tool. Both, make sure you do both of the rooms so they look equal. And then changing all of the walls to fences. There are a couple where I just delete them because I need Sims to be able to access the monkey bars for example so I just delete those walls and then I'm placing in all of my columns and all of the corners just so obviously the roofs aren't floating and placing in my ladders just doing simple things like the flooring obviously you can do this however you want it to look now for the slide, you're gonna go in with a half gabled roof and make it so it's only one tile big. You can see here, and I'm extending the roof out the top using this other arrow, not the arrow that makes the size bigger, it just extends the roof up. And also bringing in either side, um, so it's super, super skinny. And then if you press Shift C while you're on the roof, you'll get these four points. And what you can do is you can jiggle these about to get exactly what you want then like a nice curve and um, so i'm just curving these till they look sort of like a slide obviously this is not functional but it's just for looks and i'm using the metal roof from equal lifestyle because i find this was what looks most like slide and then i use a really chunky um border because i feel like that looks like the side of a slide and you might need to do some readjusting again just so it doesn't clip through the floor so I am just scooching that down. So I'm also removing this part of the fence here just so Sims can access this bit. You can put whatever you like in here. And then I'm gonna make this wall that's near the monkey bars. I'm gonna make it into a fake climbing wall. Again, not functional, but it looks sort of cute. So I use the fossils for this. So if you hold Alt, you can see that the rock goes through it, but if you hold Alt, it only goes halfway through the wall. So if you press Alt, and then raise these up, spin these around, make some smaller. You can make it look a bit like a climbing wall. And that's it for this one. I also designed this other one so you can get it in really different looks. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye.